Hello and welcome to Art Swarm episode 8 of series 2. Art Swarm is a, an experimental video music audio program where people send in things on a particular theme and then I showcase it to the world. So everything you're about to see is a world premiere, something that's been specifically made and sent to the program. Now each episode's got a theme and this theme is New York. And I'm going to bring you two poems two pieces of music and two videos that combine a bit of each. And we're going to start with a poem by regular, reasonably regular contributor Stephen Pennell with his thoughts on New York. Once Twin Towers stood in the city King Kong fell in love Yellow taxis swarm like stripeless bees and a skyline that silhouetted on my mind. And with them sirens screaming and Broadway calling, Times Square's lights hurting your eyes, Central Park its breathing lung, a countryside oasis and a concrete corset, Greenwich Village its arts, its crafts and Wall Street all big business and brash. United Nations share this town, musicals and big fight nights, basketballs, glow trotters strut their funky stuff and the Yankees play class baseball, all in all New York you've blown my mind. Next we have a piece of music, the first contribution from Andrew Williams. This is a relaxing ambient piece of music inspired by a music preset called City, which is a pink noise hiss of a theme. It's entitled Central Park and includes some photographs which Andrew took himself. Next I present a video piece by Deborah Edgeley. This began as a sentence and a series of words loosely connected to New York and the, sen the words then gradually repeat in a random order creating a sense of 
chaos and disintegration. Liberty goddess unzips her liberty bodice, craving frog's legs, sick of pizza aroma, burps from orange corona, the sidewalk avenue, big apple, Miss America takes a bite, aroma sick, legs bodice, goddess unzips her liberty, corona burps from Sidewalk, apple big, throw the dice, corona aroma legs, her liberty, burps, sidewalk, America bite, big apple statue, sick of orange from burps, bodice, goddess, liberty, bodice, sick of pizza, frogs, sidewalk. America apple, crunch, burps, orange, sick, craving, bodice, liberty, bodice, goddess. And now, Andrew Williams' second piece of music was inspired by Frank Sinatra's New York song. But the very electronic, brassy sounds they created resulted in some strange new electronic work that's really a unique hybrid. And next we have a poem from new contributor Randall Horton. This is all about the grim reality of New York City versus its romantic, bohemian, artistic 
feeling. New York, you were tough, an apple dreaming hippo. You crushed the downtrodden underfoot, underground, under influence. You were made of broken dreams, broken promises, and broken spirits. You have digested the sensitive in your belly, then expelled them in a spew of rough trade and tough luck. The cords of desperation banged through the rafters, the ink of melancholy dripped from canvas and brick. The method of stage was unremitting anguish, the surviving superstars staggered to fame. I dreamed your streets, child that I was. Delicious discord seduced me. What could continuous conflict create? The VU, the Dawes, Jane County all beckoned. How can the forbidden tempt so freely? Unshackled from safety and skidding on the edge of sharpened blades, walking on debauchery's needles, dancing in the freedom of heady despair, I fancied myself coursing through your basements, alleys, and rivers. I would arise, piss-stained and battered, to conquer sanity and civility. Damned decency is doomed. Now you cradle the coddled with cocktails that cost more than my rent. Your art is either timid or indulgent. Your streets are sterile and sanitized, welcoming only the well-heeled. Artists for profit. Greed spurs the creative urge. Patrons prefer being seen to seeing or hearing. Your decadence is repressive, never liberating. Now, when I consider the theme New York, I instantly thought of Philip Glass and his um, minimalist repetition of music. So I decided to make a piece of music very much in the Philip Glass style of light, repetitive theme with darker chords beneath. Um, but then I thought it'd be more interesting to take it to another level. So because my music was uh, digitally sequenced rather than analog, it can't disintegrate in the same sort of way. So I made it, I made the second half, yeah, I made the computer pick random notes based on the notes in the first half. And so the, the second half, like Deborah Edgley's, Edgley's poem, disintegrates into a sort of chaos based on the order in the first half. There's a switch point halfway through. Um, I combined it with some stock footage of New York in 1951, and that adds even more to the Coyonis Catsy sort of feel to it.
brings us to the end of our short Arts One programme, Six Pieces. Um, I hope you've enjoyed that. Well, that was interesting. If you'd like to create something for Arts One, well, that would be fantastic. You can find some information on how to do that on marksheekycom slash artswarm.php. Uh, the next theme is gardening. If you'd like to make something and send it, the whole programme is based on just making something. I want to go. Yes, my name's Mark Sheeky, and you can catch up with the programme and keep up to date with all the links and calls by visiting Twitter at Artswarm TV. We also have a Facebook page which I use less often. Um, but meanwhile, do subscribe to the channel if at all possible. I'll see you for the next episode.